Okay, at last I've finished the uh, semi-restoration of this traffic light. It's not a complete restoration like I've seen some other people do very skillfully. But this one uh, this is an old light from the 40s from uh, New York City. Queens, I think, according to the guy who sold it to me. And it um, was originally painted black and then many coats of yellow over that. Uh, so I had it sandblasted. Um, and then I painted it really just the exterior with uh, Rust-Oleum gloss black. And uh, let's see, what else? I had uh, help from some other people like um, uh, Gordon out in uh, Nevada who uh, rewired the sockets for me and uh, Sean up in Canada who, uh, what did Sean do? He gave me the, uh, he sold me the controller that it's running on right now and it's running in a sequence like New York City's lights. I remember a few of these still being around when I was a kid like this. Uh, let's see, what else was cool about this light? Um, well, it just looks good. It's a neat looking thing. The lenses are all pretty much original, except I replaced one uh, that had been broken, and I actually fixed another broken one, glued it with crazy glue. It was in two pieces, and it was not too hard to glue back. It's not perfect, but you can't really tell. So, uh, anyway, another look at this. It's a three-way light, meaning it faces in three directions. This direction here has these blank ends on it um, because it was just facing, there was no cars or whatever, no traffic coming from that direction, like a three-way intersection or whatever it was, or a one-way intersection. So there you have it. I love this thing. It looks good. I don't have anywhere to put it but the floor, but cool.